Here we are at the depot, waiting on Seadale to show the fuck up. Is this Jules? Is this Jules right here? Who is it? Who is he? Here, run me over. He's a crazy son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, here she is. The lady of the hour. Hopefully he puts sound over all this shit. Hurry the fuck up! It's a cold bitch out here. Okay, I did bring something special. And that is a shibit doll. Oh shoot. And the Shibit doll is an ancient Egyptian doll. I don't think Jill's, Jill's seen it yet. Do you remember how to turn that light on? There you go. I got this from an archeologist in Colorado. And we found out that every time we pull this out, something happens, you know what I mean? Like we pulled it, I, did we pull it out with you? Uh, we were gonna, but we never did. That's right. We, we pulled, brought it, but we didn't pull it out. Um, me and my sister, I think, and Alethea pulled this out. And in the live stream, we were catching a bunch of like anomalies or orbs like flying around it. Um, we had an uh, Egyptian word come through the spirit box and microphonic app. And then we figured out that if we use the Google Translate, we can talk to it. And we said ahalan, which means hello in e Egyptian. And then that opened up like a whole can of worms for us. So hopefully we get something with this. And then when I first got this too, I didn't want to open it right away. And it almost felt like a good luck charm. Like I had like a weird feeling when I got, when I got it, but I couldn't help it. I opened it up. That was weird. Huh? Is it just me? Right, that thing has to use static electricity, right, to go yeah. off? Yeah, I'm not very staticky, I can't make it for sure. Shoot, I forgot that. Forgot that. You want to grab that SB11, Jules? <clears throat> the OG spirit box? Yeah. So we have here an NEM Master and also the Shibit doll and a candle. As a custom to Aaron Martin. Um, now let's see what we get. If there's anybody in this building, make sure you come towards this candle and speak directly into this device that I'm holding. And we'll get your voice out there. Shoot, do I, my battery's really dying? Does that take a nine volt? Yeah, yep, I got battery We died. got a bunch of nine volts over there. Yeah. I need a new one. That's weird. Usually those things last for fucking... Did we replace know. it last time? We only time used too? it twice. Well, yeah, because I put a new battery and we went to our last one and... Dealing with spirits. Just draining batteries. <laughs> just one? Yeah. Fuck. Was that you? Uh-uh. Jules? -uh. Was that you? Was that thumped? Devil. A thumped. There's like a duke. Mm. Have a copper show up and then we freaking got a camera light in the middle of the room. <laughs> like a part of the chamber. Yeah, I think that was just you banging something yeah. over there. I think that's what we do. That's what it sounded like. Praying for good fortune. All right, guys, ready? Fucking born ready. Anyways, people, this is the fucking depot. It's the main little hall here, which this was probably the waiting room at first, huh? I Where would they had all so. the pews and shit. Yeah. We're hoping to fucking get out here. On the boat. 
Dang, is that a bullet hole? No way. Wanna go first? Is there anybody here with us? Can you speak into that black box for us? I know they had some, um, some of the chambers members said that they hear either thumps in here or they hear footsteps walking around in here. Um, I'm not sure what else. I know a lot of other people had some stories too that in lots of page. Maybe we should cut our lights and just let that one run over there, do you think? If you're in this building, make your way into this, this grand hall. And speak directly into that, or that device right there. We brought a, brought a special artifact with us too. Sometimes you can run these things forever and not get anything on them. Is there anybody here with us? Can you blow on that candle or blow it out? Or touch that antenna on the floor? If you touch that antenna, it makes a really cool noise. Hey, hello? Also with me, uh, we got Jules over there on the handheld. Got Aaron Baker. My name is Sidelli Nick. We're listening to Fallen Hour Radio. If you guys are just tuning in, about whether you're on Facebook, say hey. Yeah. yeah. Did you say hey? I was over like a few sweeps too, huh? Can you give us your name? <laughs> you don't do that. <laughs> Did you just get the heebie jeebies? <laughs> Are you here waiting for the train?
Were you a patron here before? Have you lived in Hardin or just passing through? Oh fuck. Uh, I oh, my hands on. Huh? I was like, I just felt like cold right here. Did you guys should turn on that, um, the temperature reader? What? The temperature reading on it or no? Well, I think it's this fan board. Yeah, I think so. I'm gonna go see if I can shut it off. Oops. See how prepared we are. If you're in this building, come and speak with us. Say hello again. There we go. <clears throat> My name's Aaron. What's your name? What was that? We didn't hear you. Can you say that again? It's not like it's safe. Yeah, I'm gonna let it run through this for a second, and then I'm gonna put a low patch on it, and then see if we get anything there. It runs at a lower frequency too. All right. Remember guys, we're still fairly, fairly new to this kind of stuff, so. Still learning how to do the equipment. <laughs> Is that like a freaking guitar? Like a guitar solo real <laughs> I wonder if that antenna, hold on. Okay, it's off. That doorway leads to a hallway that leads to the Chamber of Commerce office. Ooh, what the hell? What'd you say? Oh, I was talking to the camera. Oh, all right, I'm gonna run a low pass now. Fuck, my camera just like unfocused itself. You hit the photo button to focus it back in, right? Hold on a second. There we go. Where is the freaking... As you can see is a reflection of Jules' glasses over there <laughs> and a shadow on the wall. Over there making sock puppets with his hands, shadow puppets. Okay, I'm running on FM. Uh, sweet rate is 150. The antenna is off, by the way. There shouldn't be any radio coming through. If you're still here with us, talking to the antenna of that machine or wherever the light is. I feel like I'm hearing something like really low. Are you hearing it? Like it's talking in there, but it's like really low. Yeah. I know those first two voices we got, it sounded like the same voice, but I couldn't understand it. But I'm deaf as shit, too. So those Jules were just old men here. <laughs> then we got Cedo the Kid. <laughs> I'm pretty deaf. <laughs> yeah, that was weird. Yeah. What's your name? We heard you come through, you're a male. You do that again? How about you knock for us somewhere in this building?
Is there somewhere you would like us to go? If you can, get some cool shots too of like Jules and myself or this or, you know what I mean? Like just like slowly pan or whatever. And then um, I'll use that. Um, We're just, all three of us are gonna have to face each other like it's a fucking, <laughs> the good, the bad, the ugly. <laughs> Are you a spirit that's died on these trade tracks? That's a good question. Is he still alive? Let me show the people the little shibit doll. People there, got 14 people in the live stream. And we are at the depot. So I do have some history of this building. Um, I'll go through it in a second, but I do have something I want to show you guys. This is called a ship it doll. And do you want to shut that spare box off? Go ahead, yeah. We'll run the necrophonic. This is a Shibit doll, and this is an ancient Egyptian artifact that I got from an archaeologist down in Colorado a few years ago. And we have a video, I think, a video on my Facebook page and on YouTube. And we figured out that once we pull this out of the case, because I have a specialized case for this thing, um, we had some anom anomalies show up. We had, we were able to communicate with it through Google Translate and put in words in English and it would translate it through Egyptian. And we were actually getting some intelligent responses to Egyptian, putting those back into the Google Translate. And that's all on our YouTube channel, I think. So we have this with us. Um, I'm hoping that this upticks some activity. Hopefully, because the last couple ones, I think were just like auditory. Um, mostly through the apps or through our equipment but i actually i want to hear something like physically you know what i mean i want to hear i want to hear something like knock or see something on camera you know well i shut the heater off too <laughs> Surfaces in here, huh? Is that Daryl again? Is it Daryl or girl? Oh, I had somebody that I know personally. Uh, she doesn't want her name to be put out, but she met, she said that she had some history with that person asking about Daryl. Um, I haven't heard anything back yet. That's what we kept hearing at Bullets was that it was Daryl. Yep. Yeah. So I'll have to go and ask, Darryl. see what that's about. Who's Daryl? Yeah. What's your name? Don't fucking 
say Daryl Easy. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anybody here in the depot with us? Dude. <laughs> if your name is Daryl, what do you have to do with Harden? Or the Bullets building. Is there a tunnel under this building? If he's a keeper. Sounds like freaking um, Voldemort. The bullet <laughs> 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 Did it say boy again? Yeah. Boy me. You haven't impressed us so far. Can you knock on something in another room or in this room? Are you screen recording? Screen record. Huh? Screen record that so I can take it. I need that. Screen record on the iPhone? Yeah. Yeah. Swipe. Yeah. Have, you been, have you not screen recorded before? No. Yeah. Um, I don't even know how you got it. Do you have an iPhone? Is this right? like the 90s? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 Which one's the screen? It's 2024. <laughs> 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 Let's see. Hold on. Look at this guy. <laughs> the light Is it not the right, right <laughs> widget? <laughs> it's like you don't have it on here. Go to your settings. Right at. I have it all the way up and now it ain't making any noise. We heard about a tunnel here, but I haven't confirmed it yet. I also just joined the Chamber of Commerce, so I don't know if they know anything or. No. Fuck whatever that was. Huh? How much the end of that. Why is this still going? I just talked it. What do you mean? Put on the um, echo, not the reverb. Okay. What did what cost back in the day? What did uh, fry bread cost back in the day? Oh, Fuzz, you get a good fry bread for like a dollar fifty. <laughs> Probably a type less, a way less than that. I'm talking about my day. If you wanted chili and the fixings on it, it was about five dollars. Was there a hanging tree? Yeah, you just go to a fucking buddy's house. And then they force it upon you. We had a spirit box with us also. Did you hear that? Yeah. Can you do that again? Where was that at, do you think? It's that like on the back door, huh? Let's go back there. Where was that at, do you think? Where was that at, do you think? Where was that at, do you think? You're like on the window over there? Yeah. Hold on, is it running? Press the wrong button just now. We heard something tap somewhere. Is that you? You can see the light on the train. Dude, it is so cold in this room. I know, I don't see anybody outside either. Kind of changed the atmosphere a little bit, but not, not enough. Maybe that train going by will help. <laughs> I mean, I like it. Was that cable cart always pulled that far out? Is that the table cart.
this building. Get off that train right now. Get off the train. Yeah. Once I get that IR cam over, definitely not have the light. <laughs> this guy's losing fucking rings in here. <laughs> fucking Sonic the Hedgehog. How'd you move that fucking fast, dude? Me? Remember <laughs> when I turned around and put this camera down, I saw you standing like right there. As soon as I just turned around, it was like freaking um, Pass as fuck, boy. Like quarters. <laughs> And then he lost his rings. <laughs> it wasn't my fault. Oh, fucking Sonic the Hedgehog. Who the hell said that to me? Oh, this gal, oh, this gal, and um. Dude, my freaking. My. One of my necklaces broke. And then I stepped on my bandana. And my <laughs> chain. <laughs> my chain broke on my wallet. And just I freaking had. Uh, just too many fucking accessories, bro. Fuck. Damn, damn. <laughs> Gotta accessorize. It's who I am. You're too loud. <laughs> yeah, fuck. <laughs> you don't even have to say nothing. You're loud as shit. <laughs> you hear me walking in the room? I hear like sleigh bells jingling, and I'm like, it's Cedale coming. <laughs> <laughs> All aboard. Right. Everybody was saying that too, if we uh, move the Chamber of Commerce to another building, we have to move this train somewhere. Oh, really? Like, how do we move a freaking train? The Centennial Train. Oh, it's got all the murals. So did this thing just move around to showcase the artwork on the side? Is that pretty much what this is? Probably. I mean, it has a description right there, but I can't read that far. I'm blind. Montana's greatest publicity stunt. <laughs> Well, yeah, everybody, we were freaking, the tracks are just right here next to the depot. <clears throat> Sketchy. It gets pretty sketchy when that train goes by. <clears throat> this train car used to actually sit where the Lariat Motel is. I don't know where it's at before that. It's actually not that cold in here. Some old ass freaking. Oh shit, I was just like, dude, I just locked us in here. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> it must be the brakes for the car right there. Oh yeah, that's cool. Some old fire extinguishers. Oh, psh, it's not even connected to anything. <clears throat> just to start moving on. JMC truck service.
It's weird. It looks like an office building in here. Yeah, they said this could be used for an office, and I was like, hmm. I was like, no. Nah. Fucking old paper, man walks on the moon. What? Yeah. For the real? Gazette. Wow. Wonder how old Paul oh, sixty, huh? Or sixty, right? <laughs> Yeah. 69. 69. Good year. Right now, in front of everyone. Hold the camera. We're cold. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Hold on a second. I don't think there's really anything in this place. You don't think so? It doesn't feel weird in here at all. Mm. Go back to the depot. Yeah. See how our live stream's doing. Yeah. Uh, we'll try one more thing at the depot. At least we have footage of in here so people know. Yeah. <clears throat> There's a bunch of badass old pictures in here. Got hot cocoa for days in this bitch. Fuck, make up, make up a batch real quick. Fucking hot cocoa, fucking cans of that shit, some apple cider. Fuck the apple cider. I tapped on the glass in here to get the fuck out of him. Speak to us. I gotta provoke it. Did that camera go? Oh, <laughs> Is there anybody in here? Did, did you guys wait for us to leave to come in? Do you not like us in here? Did you just say train? This is the depot. Get with it. Get with what? I'm gonna separate and go this way. I feel like there's something in this room, but I don't know what. And I apologize that we gotta use lights. We don't have an IR system yet, but we will. Can you speak into the mic on my chest? You guys, I heard like a, a soft moan. Can't hear anything Cedil says. Can you repeat what he's saying to me? Is there anybody in here with us? Yes or no? Is there tunnels underneath this place? Can you tell me what Cedell's doing in the next room? Is 
<clears throat> if there's spirits in here, you could use my cell phone to speak to us. The cell phone is what's in my hand. Can you knock on the wall? I feel like that's a good thing though, because we're getting a buttload in the other buildings. I'm trying to get this freaking flash to turn on. There we go. Should we go in the office? Yeah, let's do that. And run the neck we box. haven't gone in there yet. I run the uh, spirit box. Yeah. He said nothing has happened since we've gotten this building again. Usually they say that if it's it's in the least active room. This is the least active room? Well, they, no, they say that. Usually they hang out in the least active room, but... Dude. Oh. What is that? There's a body in there. A body in a trash bag? Just sitting up there? You wanna go check it out, Jules? Just give yourself the fucking chills. No. I didn't. No. <laughs> <laughs> you looked pretty disgusted over there. Fucking ladder, too. Yeah, Fuck better yeah. get up there. Take the flashlight. Do it, you know? You're the skinniest person here. <laughs> How much do you weigh? I weigh 210. I'm like 208. I'm 250. 235. Whatever. I was 210, but. I went hungry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The room that's a leaf after would probably be that storage room, huh? What is it? With the balls. <laughs> what? The storage room with the balls would probably be the least active room right. where people go in. I think so. We try. Everything up in there. You see that? Oh. I don't know if that's good. Can you speak to us through this device that I'm holding? Clearly and loudly, please. Bruh. Bruh. I got that on the neck of fall, too. Bruh. Oh, we're getting a lot more now. That's a low-pass low, low pass filter on it. Is there a way to get to the tunnels from here? What? Are the tunnels even real in Harden? Is there anybody here with us? Yeah, the antenna is off. <clears throat> if there are any spirits here, you can use this device to talk to us. Here. 
<laughs> was it pretty funny when I scared Jules over here? <laughs> if you're here, why don't you shut the door to the room? Did it say no? It sounded like it. I'm gonna play hide and seek. Are you trapped here? Do you need help moving on? This guy's just being this genius over here. Do you not like it when he does that? Are you scared to talk to us? Are you a coward? <clears throat> Do you want us to leave? should we go in? Can you repeat that? Somebody said every time you ask a question, the light flickers. Maybe the wind, I don't know. Are you a man or a woman? I gotta go sit in that room myself. Come in here and talk to us. Can you knock for us?
Is there anything underneath this building? Do you want us to go away? I'm gonna go sit in that room and see if I catch anything by myself. Okay. Do you have that reader? Keep asking questions. The, this? Yeah. Do I get anything? I think you guys wanna take stills in here if you're taking them there. Oh, I don't care. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna go sit in that room alone. That's six of you watching, uh, make, make sure you share the stream. I know it's like one o'clock in the morning, but the full cut will be out Friday Why night. Why is there all this champagne in here? Do you like to party? Yeah? Yeah. I like to party too. There's 99 bottles of booze on the wall in here. Yep. You want me to open that champagne bottle? What did it say? Sounds like it said fuck. What did it say what? Fuck. Fuck. I was thinking fuck or four. <laughs> Do you stub your toe? <laughs> nope. Nope. What's your name? Where are you standing in front of? What town are you from? Are you from Harden? Scared? You already get too scared out there? No, here. Do you guys hear anything? I don't know if I hear anything, I'll ask you guys. <laughs> Is he going up there for real? Yeah. Hey, if you can open that, I'll hand you my camera and <laughs> just leave you there. guys alone for a second. Oh, man, scary as hell. It looks scary. Do you want to come back there? <laughs> You're almost there. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> like fucking honey. Oh, shit. <laughs> What's there's, wrong? There's literally two more steps on his leg. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. Dude, I don't even know. Uh, try stepping again. 
You got think, it, bro. I don't think they're moving. No. No, that's solid. I hope it's solid because this thing's. <laughs> As the side goes over and shakes it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so open the trap that door. Far down from up, you know. The old trap door. The old fucking <laughs> trap door. <laughs> well, your feet are like maybe like four feet off the ground. There's a desk underneath it. You can always jump on this printer. Yeah. <laughs> it's a printer. <laughs> I'll catch you. I'll catch you. <laughs> <laughs> Trust Paul. Oh, lay your hands on me. <laughs> what the fuck? What is that? It's the latch. Oh, fuck yeah. Ooh. And we'd have to get one more step up. Yep. Just one more. Yep, you're good. Dude, that is sketchy. Look at that nail oh, sticking in. Oh, that's because I had that wind chime hanging off of it. Oh. Just a bunch of insulation. Yeah. Hey. Oh fuck. Hey, put a camera up there. Well, how am I supposed to hold the door? Oh yeah, right. Right. <laughs> the old fucking door thing. There's nothing I can use to. Holy shit. Is there a bunch of shit up there? I just see this papa rat. Oh, what? Pumping the shit out of a mama rat. Who <laughs> 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 fucked just like us? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, this should be on the live stream. <laughs> Fuck, is this a lot of fucking... Insulation? Yeah. That sucks. No board, no nothing. All right, let's, uh, why don't we leave that live stream going? Let's take five, I'm going to take five minutes in there, shut you guys in here, and then when that five minutes is up, let's save the rest of this battery for that back room. Oh, it's like way off. Yeah, this, the, the doors are closed in this room now. Can you go and knock on the door that Aaron and Jules are in? I feel like it's saying Jewel. Lemon. There's Susan. Susan, can you say fall an hour? Can somebody new say fall an hour? Say it clearly. Here's the doll. Can you knock? Make a thumb.
The knock on Aaron's door. Here. On Aaron's door. And Joel's door. Or my door. Oh, by the way. Uh, the thing I wanted to do was take photos outside of these windows. Um, there's a really scary story that I just don't like. Uh, well, actually, there's a... I'll put it in the episode, but... Um, there's this guy that claims that he is visited by what he calls star children. Like an alien kind of thing. And they interrupt his phone calls all the time. Um, they uh, frequently show up in photos that he takes. And the creepiest photo that I've seen taken was by that dude. It's gotten really creepy in there. <laughs> yeah. Do you want to go do it? It's probably cold as shit in there. It is. It's cold now. <laughs> it was, it got active there for a second. I stood up. Is there? I stood up and it told me to sit down. That Susan voice came through. Probably. You think that's it? Shut it down? Is it? Yeah. yeah, I think my light is dead too. The only lights that that's running is that one. Yeah, I don't think anything's in here, man. Did you guys catch anything in there? Yeah, I didn't really catch anything in here either. Yeah. The only thing that I can think of is after footage, like our photos and things. Wanna snap some photos? Turn it off? Okay. Say Aaron. I don't know. Bathroom? Say Jules? It said Jules. Where's Jules? That's what it sounded like, huh? <laughs> Big. My camera is having a hard time focusing on the live stream. It 
looks like it's like moving. Walk by this, um, walk by that, on that side again. No? Weird. Can you make a physical noise in this building? Can you knock, walk, close a door? We're stopping. Why are you stopping? You haven't even done anything yet. Say wheezy. We say one of our names. It said Jules earlier when you're outside. Maybe. Maybe. Let's say Jules. Yeah, he's really posing. <laughs> Can you knock three times? All right, we can keep you guys on here. If you guys get a chance, go visit fallenhour.com. I'll be updating it tonight uh, with ways to purchase tickets. Um, we have somebody new in town that is going to be joining our raffle. So if you guys want to join a paranormal investigation, we have some new locations that open up, including a house call. Um, we may be in the works of getting into the Becker, the Four Aces. Um, we can take you guys back to Bullets if you want. But uh, you get, uh, like, like it's mentioned on the screen, you get everything there and also we have red light, spa, and tanning joining. And the, she, Missy there is going to put something else into the drawing. If you guys are in the Hardin area, the, the Grizzly Ground is open from 7 to 4.30, I think. And Praying Woman Boutique is open from 1 to 5. And there's tickets available there, and also our stickers are available at Praying Woman Boutique.